We got Lewis Carroll, Alice in Wonderland, and Through the Looking Glass. Uh, this is a pretty dull cover. Listen, you only needed a little thing here to make it pop, like a little white rabbit or something, right? But that's just my taste. Anyway, let's let's get to it. Alice in Wonderland, absolutely amazing. It's it's an amazing. It, it's legendary. All right. There's not a lot to say. The humor is fantastic. The characters are. A bit too much sometimes, a bit too much, right? Uh, especially the Mad Hatter and the Queen. They're kind of annoying sometimes, but that's just me. Uh, again, the humor, the imagination, the creativity, the the world itself, the characters, you know, pr pr pretty great, pretty great. Now. Uh, through the looking glass. Now listen, wh what happened here? Uh, what happened here? This is a complete farce, right? This is just like a bad, like a bad copy of Wonderland. Uh, through the looking glass is, uh, it's, it's, it's terrible. It's terrible. I almost all the time didn't know what what was happening. Who, what, where, what, what, what are we doing right now? It's like a jumbled mess. What's going on? Absolutely awful. It's awful, right? Um, which shows that sometimes uh, sequels shouldn't be written. All right. If you didn't, if you don't bring forth the same type type of creativity and passion, that that's just what happened. Through the looking glass is appalling. Because it, it, it's nothing. It, it's just something, right? It, it, it's something. But it's not on par with the excellence of Wonderland, obviously. Right? And let me tell you. Uh, in Wonderland, what I wanted to see more of was, of course, the Cheshire Cat. The Cheshire Cat is my favorite character. I mean, we're all mad here. You got me. I'm sold. Say more. Say more. I want to hear more from you. I want to see more of you. All right. And then we have some characters that just are annoying, of course. We got the, what is it, the Mad Hatter and the... Uh, what is it, the March Hare, I think, and they, you know, they're kind of hard to swallow sometimes, you know, especially at the tea party, they're just a bit too much sometimes, but I get it, we're in uh, an insane, absurd world, of course, that's the point of it, all, because it, it, is, it is a parody of, an exaggerated parody of our world, of course, uh, of the world back in the day, right? Uh, what else? You know, some things are not explained, which, of course, this was written for children, of course, so there is no need for an explanation. You know, the, the bottle with drink me just pops up, just pops up, just like that. I mean, kids are not going to question that, right? Uh, what else? Listen. After reading this, uh, I tried to watch the Disney movie, I think it was in 51, and it was just, wow, I couldn't do it. It was just, it was just torture, right? It, 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 way too much singing, way too much singing, I mean, yikes, right? But, it, it, of course, it had all the elements that I didn't like in the book, which is, some of the characters, like the Mad Hatter and the Hare and the others, they're just too much. They're, they're too much. You know, they are too exaggerated. Right? I know that was the intent, but there is just... it's Sometimes it's too much, and I just couldn't stomach the movie. I just had to drop it like, see ya. And yikes. Right? What happened to the Looking Glass? It was just... <sighs> It was a mess, boy. A mess. 
And of course, there's uh, in Wonderland, there's uh, so much symbolism, so much allegory. I mean, uh, she goes to this uh, caterpillar and uh, uh, she ad he advises Alice to eat from a mushroom and she grows uh, taller or, or smaller. Of course, <laughs> we're, de we're dealing with shrooms here, people. And that's just, uh, that's just one aspect of the symbolism right and it's not that subtle it's not that subtle right what else i mean this guy uh, lewis carroll let, let me just tell you um, say what you want about him he was a sketchy dude right he was big yikes you know how uh, alice in wonderland came to be uh, you know mad sketchy and that's all i'm gonna say about that mad sketchy Okay, uh, but I do recommend Alice in Wonderland and uh, Through the Looking Glass. Uh, you just gotta toss that in the trash. That is a complete disaster, a nightmare. I just couldn't man maintain the intention. That's how irritating it was, right? But that's about it.